Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode here at the Calumet. Today we're going to cover some of the most fundamental steps of what to do once the hardware fuel management system, wonder boxes, super boxes, and dispensers. Once they're powered up and installed, how do we get them up on my Tecalumet cloud? So we're about to go meet up with Kaylee. She's gonna walk us through some of these steps, so stay with me. Hey guys, it's Kaylee. Today we're talking about your my Tecalumet setup. So once your unit's powered up in the field, then you need to just give us a call on our tech support line. Uh, once you call us, we're gonna ask you for a serial number from the inside of your box looks just like this. It's going to have five digits on it and it should be taped either on the inside of your pedestal or inside of your door to your super box or wonder box. So once we have that we can look up what type of system you have. Then we're going to have you go online to mytecalumet.com. There's a button that says sign up here. Once you click that you're going to type in your information, your email, the password that you want to set. Make sure that the language option says English and then it's gonna send you an activation email. You're gonna click on that activation email and it's gonna tell you that your account is now activated and it's gonna take you back to the MyTechAlimit website. You're gonna log in and then you're gonna have two different options. You're gonna have the option to create an account or you're gonna have the an option to create a department from backup. If you're upgrading from HD Manager to MyTechAlimit, it's gonna give you some instructions on how to pull a backup file from your HD manager and import that into the cloud so you're not having to re-enter those drivers or vehicles. If you're creating a department from scratch and you're gonna to need to enter all new vehicles and drivers, um, you're gonna click create new department and it's gonna ask you for some information such as the address and company name. And once you do that, then you're gonna be on the dashboard ready to enter your drivers and vehicles. Okay, so those were your most fundamental steps to get a lot of these systems up on the cloud. Remember, from us, you're going to get the most flexibility on platforms, whether it's desktop or cloud-based packages. So thank you for watching and staying with me. I'll see you guys at the next video. Thanks.